हेलो एवरीवन नमस्कार सो लेट्स सॉल्व वन मोर क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम पार्शियल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन अगेन वी आर स्टार्टिंग विथ विथ न्यू कॉन्सेप्ट सो टू स्टार्ट विथ वी आर टू सॉल्व दिस सो हाउ टू स्टार्ट नाउ देर इज समथिंग न्यू इन दिस टाइप ऑफ प्रॉब्लम एज कंपेयर टू द ऑर्डिनरी डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन वट इज न्यू Uh, just the assumption and the rules to write the complementary function and the because in this question you can see uh, one thing you can see that rhs is zero so particular integral will be zero okay so what we do while writing the, our auxiliary equation we assume we replace this d by small m and this d dash by 1 and now if i write my auxiliary equation what will be that that will be m cube minus 4 m square because d dash is 1 plus 3 m and i will equate it to 0 now if i take m common i will get m square minus 4m plus 3 equals to 0 so this is m and inside i have m square minus 3m minus m plus of 3 equals to 0 so m m common m minus 3 minus 1 common m minus 3 equals to 0 so m m minus 3 m minus 1 equals to 0 so because i have to find the values of m so three values will come let's write that as m1 m2 and m3 so m1 will be 0 as you can see m minus 3 will be 0 so from there you get the value of m2 as 3 and your m3 as 1 now how we write our complementary function in this case this is a bit different from what you saw in uh, the previous case y plus m 1x will be the first one with y plus m1 x we have f1 f2 and f3 so let's see how we write that so m1 here is 0 so we write f1 y plus m1 x so only y will come because m1 into x 0 into x plus f2 y plus m two x plus f three y plus m three x. This is your CM. Now P I is zero because the R H S is zero. Final answer you write is Z equals to C F plus P I. So z equals to c f, which is f one y plus f two y plus three x plus f three y plus x. So this is your final answer, which we are talking about. Again, this is a uh, simple. just we have to write the auxiliary equation for which replace d by m and d dash by 
get your auxiliary equation solve get the values of m and how you write your complementary function f1 y plus m1 x plus f2 y plus m2 x plus f3 y plus m3 x and so on whatever values of m m1 m2 m3 so on up to mn is there and because pi was zero because rhs was zero so we write z equals to cf plus pi there you got your answer so i hope you enjoyed it learned something new from this video hope you are watching my playlist on partial differential equation where i have discussed uh, the concepts through question from beginning of the chapter so i hope you will uh, watch that also and learn a lot from there thanks and have a nice day